In this video, I am going to explain knife edge follower uh, profile analysis. Let us first open the Adam software, the new model, click the new model and model name by default if you want you can keep it otherwise you can change the name. Here I want going to give the knife edge follower. K-N-I-F-E knife underscore E-D-G edge underscore follower. Space is not allowed and uh, apply click ok now i want to draw the cam profile so the inbuilt uh, that uh, data file will be there using the data file we going to draw the cam profile and knife edge follower profile so before going to draw that here in the go to the construction in construction this icon you can just click x y z okay then in this new part just take this new part and closed profile we want to create the closed profile so first by default to take any eight points and uh, draw the closed profile 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 then click the middle button of the mouse then this curve will be ended then uh, go to this bodies and part 2 part 2 here uh, curve 1 change the name of the curve 1 rename okay so now here you can change this name is the, the cam that cams just cam already is there so they can uh, use this uh, name as a cams now this profile just you have to modify this data because already set data is available that is preloaded uh, in the system now I, I selected that file go to the read here i'm going to use the cams data file just select the cams data file and click ok ok then click OK. So now that whatever the data points are taken, that profile will be generated. Now we, we want to keep this horizon to this matching with the horizon. Then you can go for the marker, select the marker and right click, modify and the location. In the location, you want to make 0, 0. Make the 0, 0. Then apply. OK. Now you see that that profile is shifted to the horizon. Okay. Then we want to draw the, the profile of the follower. Okay. Again, go for this icon that is a construction geometry spline icon. Click this minimum eight points you can select one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Any 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 number minimum eight it will take. Okay. Then close this one and go to this part three and curve to rename this uh, curve to that is here uh, I am using this is a uh, knife edge follower knife underscore edge follower ok then apply ok now there is one uh, already it is there just click ok and change the points and you have to select whatever the points are your user go to the read and knife edge follower data and open click ok ok apply ok now it will be shifted now this horizon will match to this horizon just go to the marker 2 and modify that horizon positions you can select 0 0 0 okay. then apply ok ok so now we created now we want to assign the, the connections now go for the revolute joint click the revolute joint and make the ground and this part 2 and assign this joint next we have to follower is moving translatory motions then go for the the um, translational joint select the translational joint ground and this part 3 and assign any point here and the direction is 24 ok now we simply have to just uh, assign the joints now we want to uh, assign the connection between the follower and cam that one that one assigned by this 2d curve curve constraint icon click this one and this part 3 and part 2 then uh, that uh, the connection will be assigned then we'll go to the motions they go to the connectors the connectors joint one assign the motion to the joint one modify 
then here impose the motions okay now you can uh, impose this motion here you can use the velocity now i am keeping the 360 degrees cam rotation 360 into time apply click okay so the motion is assigned okay then after assigning the motion and go to the simulation uh, apply okay and go to the simulation okay now we can verify the data now let us first we'll give the forever and step size i'm giving the slow motion zero zero one okay then i verify the data verify it successfully click ok then you had see this uh, uh, simulation okay now you can see that uh, simulation it's uh, possible okay now we'll analyze uh, the um, uh, details and that is if you go for this uh, shading mode and you can analyze this data go to this uh, plotting option now you can select here uh, three windows and this uh, right side window you can load the animations and left side top window just uh, select the body part three or part two okay um, the part two is uh, profile and part three is follower now you see we analyze the velocity of the follower then magnitude add cause and the bottom window select next part three acceleration magnitude add cause okay now you can uh, uh, see that the simulation how it is uh, possible you now you can see that how the follower is moving cam is rotating and follower is uh, oscillating so now for each complete revolution how or what is the velocity acceleration that you are going to analyze from this graph okay i hope everybody will understand how we're going to create the cam and knife edge follower um,